they're getting pissed off because they're still playing petty games. This is out for the Seven of Cups. Choose wisely. Still playing petty games. Some homies, some friends, family, or third party, some group of people, some community, they're still playing games. Still trying to spin illusions. They could be gossiping about you because they know this person's plans, what they're going to move forward and do. They know what y'all are about to do. They know this person is teaming up with you for the future. You guys could be planning a trip or going, you guys are moving forward in another direction. Seven of Cups. They found out some kind of secret. Some friends, some homies found out some secret. And you could have found out their secrets. Somebody's friend is jealous. These people are tripping. You guys completed out a cycle. You guys have some, they know about some kind of success, victory, accomplishment. What are they doing? These people have no fucking life. I mean, these, these people are playing games still. Doing each and everything to avoid their own transformation. They need to go self-reflect. They're scared and terrified. What is going on? What are they scared of? Crying over spilled milk. They're sad. Could be depressed. Because there's some kind of loss. So this could be the end of a friendship. Scared, terrified. Yeah, these are karmics. There's discord between y'all or this is the end of a connection or relationships. They just got to move on. I'm sorry, but yeah, you're releasing them. Four coins reversed. They're really insecure. You're releasing these people, a person. This looks like a group of people. They're doing each and everything to avoid their transformation. This is sad. You're trying to come out of the cold. Come out of this struggle. And they're mad at you because you're trying to come out of some struggle and tough times, hard times. Like, what the hell? They're heartbroken. These are manipulative friends or family. These could be narcissists. You could not be speaking much to them. They feel like you're hiding something. You're not telling them the truth or something like that. They could be trying to confuse you. Ace, they're in cognitive dissonance. Ace of Swords reverse. They're trying to confuse a feminine energy or somebody somebody about a feminine energy. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This looks like your lover, your twin flame. They're, they're not doing good. They're feeling very, very unstable and insecure. They want you to think this person is cheating on you two of coins they want you to feel like they're juggling you they're cheating this is them trying to make you feel insecure oh my god show me this two of coins they're codependent as fuck two of pentacles assertion aries energy they don't like that you're independent or becoming independent or doing your own thing. Idealism reverse, sun in Aquarius. Yeah, they don't have no type of independence, no, no sense of self, nothing like that. They're codependent. This is so fucking sad. They're defensive. Mars and Taurus. They want to hold on to you as a security blanket and some of these people for money. Defensive. You're done. You've moved on. They're trying to steal from you. They're afraid to be alone. They're Kevin. Oh, carrying heavy burdens. Somebody's name could be Kevin. They're sad and stuff. 
Ten of Wands. They got so much burdens and baggage and problems. This is some rock bottom situation here. These people are terrified and just traumatized. 